Hello guys, so today with this video I thought I'd do something a bit different and talk about the games I will be playing this year. I don't buy as many games as I used to. I like to use my time to not only play games but also socialise, watch YouTube, make videos and go on holidays. But this year there are three games that I've had my eye on. Let's go through them. I put a good chunk of hours in Diablo 3 a number of years ago and rather enjoyed it. So when I knew Diablo 4 was coming, I was looking forward to it. I played two of the betas and got to level 25 in both of them, which I think was the maximum level during the beta. I wanted to try different classes during each of them, so in one of them I was a sorcerer and the other I used necromancer. I was happy with the beta, but I wasn't sure I would enjoy the full game as much as I had hoped, but I still kept my pre-order and decided to try another new class when I got the game. This time I went with Druid. I found it okay early on. I did struggle mid-game of the level 50s and when things start getting harder. I'm not overly familiar with some of the Diablo terminology, but I follow class guide videos on YouTube and managed to find a video that could dumb it down enough for me to structure my Druid build properly. Now I am actually enjoying it a lot more, now that I understand it a lot better. I can stomp through events, dungeons and have a great experience grinding out those unique items. As of this video going live, I am currently level 80. Next up is Crash Team Rumble. I wasn't sure about this game if I'm honest. Thankfully, again, a beta was available and I think I played about 5 or 6 matches or so during the beta, so I definitely wasn't hooked by it. Upon release I was lucky enough to get the game a day early and I definitely enjoyed it a lot more as I played more matches. I played quite a bit and I was changing my character most matches to keep the levels evened out. In terms of being frustrated with the game, the thing which stands out the most is definitely the bots. They definitely need an improvement. At the moment the fun hasn't lasted very long for me. Have I enjoyed it? Yes. The quick fast paced matches are good but I'm also finding myself getting quite bored quite quickly after about 5 or so matches. I played the game with my sister for some time and personally I do find the game a lot more enjoyable with friends. Overall I played the game for the first week and haven't touched it since. Damn, a real shame. Last but not least the game I am looking forward to the most, the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. I'm a big fan of multiplayer horror games having played a very large amount of hours on Friday the 13th and Dead by Daylight. The Texas Chainsaw Massacre looks right up my street. They did a technical test for this game, but I couldn't play it as I was away on holiday at the time. But I've watched numerous videos and I really like the look of this game. It definitely appeals to me very much. It comes out on the 18th of August and I'll be pre-ordering very soon and playing the hell out of it, no doubt. And those are my three games for this year. Have you played any of them or are planning to? Let me know in the comment section and I will see you soon. Thank you for watching.